Hey guys, just a quick one for you. Oculus Couch Mode, what does it do and is it any good? Stick around if that's of interest to you. Oh, and by the way, that's my cat Lucille. She's gonna be taking part in this short today. So here we are in my study, and as you can see behind me is my sofa. What I want to show you is how I'm gonna make that sofa part of my virtual environment by adding it into my Oculus Quest 2. The new Oculus Quest feature is there to expand guardian mode by letting you mark your real sofa as part of the virtual environment. So rather than it being an obstacle, it's now gonna be part of your virtual space. <laughs> yes! That's awesome! Okay, so when in your Oculus Quest, within the menu, go over to the settings and click away. And within here, you're gonna to want to scroll down to, I think it's experimental features. Yep, that's the one. And then scroll down in there, and what you want is to bring your sofa into VR. So just click on the add remove button. So in here, I'm getting redraw, but you'll probably get create. Okay, so that's us looking through my pass through, and that's my sofa. And all you need to do is hold down your trigger and draw a rectangle. And you may need to draw around your cat on the way. You then just need to stretch that blue rectangle all the way across to the length of your sofa. That's pretty straightforward stuff, even when you are smashing into your chair. You should now be able to confirm that. And there you go, your sofa is covered with a blue virtual space. Now back within the Quest, I can see my sofa in the virtual environment and it's in the same place as my real world room. So I'm gonna sit down and as you see, I'm sitting down, you get a confirm button to agree you're sitting there. Again, pretty easy stuff. So I personally think this is a really cool feature. It's actually one of the many things that Oculus are doing at the moment to you know, further improve that experience in our virtual worlds. I would love to know what you think, so please do leave a comment below. So that's it guys, it's as simple as that. A very straightforward tutorial, which I hope was of use to you. Please remember to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel and take care and see you in the next one.